Hey everyone, this is Josh with another Bitcoin and blockchain tutorial available at ChainTUTS.com. And today we're talking about scams. It's an unfortunate reality that with the amazing new technology that is cryptocurrency, there are people out there that are willing to take advantage of it and steal from others. So we're going to talk about the three most common cryptocurrency scams that are out there and how you can avoid falling victim to them. If you enjoy this free and open source educational content, don't forget to subscribe and share chain tutorials with others. So let's talk about the first most common crypto scam that I see. And this one recently came to the front lines with the Twitter hack that involved many prominent people in the space having their accounts compromised and used to promote this scam. This is the crypto doubling or giveaway scam. So with these scams, people use high profile YouTube accounts or Twitter accounts to promote a scam in which they'll ask you to send some amount of Bitcoin or another cryptocurrency to them and they claim that they will double that amount and send it back to you. So for example, someone might pose as Elon Musk or Andreas Antonopoulos and say they're feeling generous and if you send them one Bitcoin, they'll send you two back. Now this is an outright scam that you can't do anything about if you fall victim to it. Bitcoin transactions are irreversible by design. So if you send your money off to somebody else in one of these scams, they're simply just going to take the money and run. If somebody truly is feeling generous and wants to donate you some cryptocurrency to help introduce you to the space, you never have to send money to them first to verify your address or anything like that. You would simply just have to give them your purely public address that they really can't use against you other than perhaps some anti-privacy tracking. So again, never send money to somebody claiming that they're going to give you more crypto in return. They won't. The next type of scam that I often see is the cryptocurrency recovery or Bitcoin generation scam. In this type of fraud, what I'll see is people using fake YouTube accounts to post comments all over popular crypto education videos like the ones that I post. Uh, I especially see this on the videos that I've made particularly pertaining to recovering lost funds in certain scenarios where it's possible. These scammers claim that if you only talk to somebody on their Instagram account or their WhatsApp, that this genius hacker will be able to recover your Bitcoin no matter what, or perhaps even generate you Bitcoin using some magical method. Now, it's kind of a dead giveaway that in most scenarios that they claim to be able to recover or generate new coins, it's technically impossible to do so. If you send Bitcoin off to somebody else's address, you can't get it back. There's only select scenarios which you might mistakenly send to one of your own addresses and not see the fund show up that you can actually do a recovery. And it's certainly not possible to just magically generate bitcoins. Mining is an expensive, electricity intensive operation that requires significant upfront investment. And if you give some stranger on Instagram $300, they're not going to give you much more back in bitcoin. So with this scam, they often try to get from you uh, exchange credentials, two-factor authentication codes, or even your recovery seed phrase. This information you should never give to anyone else. There are select, very rare cases in which a recovery might be possible, but you would only want to give seed information to somebody that you know in person and truly trust. And even then, you're going to want to burn that seed phrase after and transfer all your funds to a new account. So never give seed phrases to anyone that you found online and that you don't know and trust. Now, the final type of scam has existed long before cryptocurrency existed. But it's a popular scam and I often see this perpetuated on LinkedIn in particular. And this is simply an investment scam. Many people will get in touch with me claiming that they are expert foreign exchange and crypto traders and that with just minimal upfront investment, they can give me outrageous guaranteed returns. 
It doesn't matter if this is crypto or gold or stocks or foreign exchange. Anyone claiming that they can give you a guaranteed return on investment is a scammer. Investment always carries risk and nobody can predict the future. As well, if an investment looks too good to be true, it probably is too good to be true. Someone claiming they could turn a few hundred dollars into thousands of dollars of profit in a week is trying to defraud you. They're going to take your money and run, or maybe in the best case scenario, you get a little bit of money back because it's a pyramid scheme and somebody is going to lose out eventually. These are not legitimate investment opportunities. And I suggest if you want to hold Bitcoin for the future, you simply buy Bitcoin and hold it yourself. Don't go chasing massive profits because they really aren't going to be real. So these are the three most common crypto scams that I have seen out there in the wild. It's always important to be thoughtful and analytical before you go falling into one of these scams. Really give some thought to who you're sending money to, who you're dealing with before you send Bitcoin off to anybody else. Remember that in the cryptocurrency world, transactions are irreversible by design. That gives the system a lot of security, but it makes it nearly impossible to get restitution if you're the victim of one of these scams. So always be cautious, always be thinking, and in general, just buy crypto and hold it for yourself. Don't go chasing massive profits with any of these types of scams. The future is bright for crypto, so if you get involved with it, if you choose to hold some crypto for the future, that is already likely to be a, a good move uh, for the future of the space. So as always, there is a written article on the Chain Tutorials website if you'd like to learn by reading rather than watching videos. And as always, I want to thank you very much for listening. I hope you learned something new with me today, and if you enjoy this content, don't forget to subscribe and share it with others.